Guys, it's been officially six months since I started using the Boca brand Nano Hydroxy Appetite toothpaste. I've got some pictures for ya. By the way, before I forget to mention, stick around to the end if you guys want to be entered into the giveaway. I'll actually be giving away an entire tube of the Boca brand Hydroxy Appetite toothpaste. So stick around to the end to get instructions on how to enter this giveaway. Okay, so first of all, if you guys are new here or if you haven't been on my channel in a while, just wanted to say that this video is part three of a little mini series that I started six months ago, all about Hydroxy Appetite as an ingredient in a toothpaste. So I'll leave a link in the description below to the other two videos. So make sure to check those out, especially the first First video if you guys are interested in learning a little bit more about hydroxy appetite I go over in depth as to what it is how it works how it compares to things like fluoride all the things so make sure to check that out link in the description below anyway it's been six months and I have some pictures to show you guys so just to refresh your memory I'm gonna show you guys how my teeth looked like before I started using hydroxy appetite toothpaste so as you can see um, the main areas of concern are the areas that I've been really monitoring to see if there would be any changes are kind of the edges of my teeth. You can see they're a little bit more or a lot more um, translucent or transparent compared to the color of my teeth closer to the gum line, as well as some areas like here and here where you see some imperfections and little grooves in my enamel where there's stain kind of getting stuck in there. So those are the areas that I've been watching. Here's another picture where my teeth are in a little bit of a different position, just so you get a different um, viewpoint. So in the two month video update, uh, I took some pictures and I compared them. Here's what the two month update looks like. And here's the second position of my teeth. So in that video, I concluded based off of the before and after photos that I did see a slight change and my viewers agreed with me. So I was pretty excited about that. Now it's been six months and I have some more photos to share with you. So again, I'm gonna show you guys the before picture. And then here is the six month update. And again, another before picture, different position. And then the six month update. So I don't know about you, but I'm having a hard time seeing much of a difference. I actually took several different photos, tried to really get the same angle, the same lighting. And at one point, uh, a couple of the photos I took, I saw quite a big difference. I'm like, wow, that looks amazing. Um, in fact, I'll, I'll show you. Here's one of the other six month updates that I took, again, compared to the before picture. But then I took another photo and here's another, again, six month update, same day, took this photo literally like minutes after, I guess I changed my camera angle maybe slightly. It's like, whoa, that's a lot darker. <laughs> so overall, looking back and forth, comparing my, my beginning photos compared to the six month update, all the photos that I took, just going back and forth, literally probably like for five to 10 minutes, I decided that I really don't see that significant of a difference. I don't know, comment below what you guys think. It was interesting in my second video update, my two month update, one of my viewers commented that ultimately I kind of have to decide for myself. Sometimes photos can be misleading, but I have to decide for myself based on what I I see in real life and honestly if I didn't have any before or after pictures just looking at my teeth I would be inclined to say that there is somewhat of a difference like my teeth feel a little bit more glossy maybe I just wish I saw a more drastic change so bottom line would I recommend this toothpaste to other people well I wouldn't not recommend it so if somebody came up to me and said hey i use the boca toothpaste what do you think i wouldn't say something like oh my gosh don't use it stop using it immediately it's a horrible toothpaste what i would say is probably something like oh how long have you been using it have you seen any results what do you think about it so i'd just be more curious about it than anything else as we all know people react differently to different products everybody's teeth are different so what may work for one person may not work for another so i would just be curious to see what other people think about it but if a person came up to me and said hey i'm thinking about using a new toothpaste what would you recommend i probably wouldn't like ecstatically tell them oh my gosh you have to use the boca toothpaste it's amazing based off of the results that i've seen over the course of six months just not drastic enough for me to be super excited about this toothpaste and to be honest Honest, I wouldn't recommend a single product to everybody across the board because again everybody has different needs different teeth they react differently to certain things so if a person uh, actually asked me like what kind of toothpaste would you recommend I would ask them more questions about like well are your teeth sensitive are you looking for whitening like are you allergic to anything 
all those questions before I would tell them or recommend to them a certain toothpaste. The other question would be, would I continue using this toothpaste? Honestly, I would say no, but mostly just because as a hygienist, I get so many samples of different toothpaste. I have a ton of toothpaste lying around my house, so I wouldn't waste money on buying another tube of Boca toothpaste because I just have so many other toothpastes. So that would be the only reason. If I didn't have any other toothpaste lying around the house, I probably would purchase another Boca tube of toothpaste just to see, because some people have said like sometimes it takes up to a year to start really seeing a difference. Personally, especially since I run this channel, I review a lot of products and I just don't have that kind of time to sit around on one product and see how it works. But yeah, I'd love to hear your guys' thoughts if you've been using the Boca toothpaste or your thoughts on my before and after photos, just any comments, love to hear from you. Moving on to the giveaway. So if you guys wanna try this product out for yourselves, what you have to do for this giveaway is number one, subscribe to this channel, number two, comment below this video, and number three, include this emoji in your comment so I know that you're not just commenting but you actually wanna be entered into the giveaway. And then check back a week from today's post date to see if you won. Alrighty, that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Take care of your teeth.